Ladies and gentlemen, Mary Manhanoni presenting automated road defect detection, known as IRDD. We'll start by presenting uh, problematic, talking about solution, presenting technical business details, and then finishing with presenting our team. Algeria is a big country that is, has a big and complex road network. These roads, are, these roads are full of defects. For instance, who among you today came and didn't find uh, a pothole along the, along the way, hafraf tariq or something like that? Uh, These de defects um, have uh, a lot of costs and uh, also are, uh, uh, they also slow traffic and have big part of the blame in accidents. Uh, for that, our solution uh, help municipalities and private road maintenance firms in uh, prioritizing which roads to uh, maintain first, those who are more critical and more important. Our solution, IRDD, is a device that does real-time detection of road defects. Uh, it, is, it uses a computing uh, board and a camera. It can be placed in any device uh, in any dashboard of any car and monitored by a mobile application. The detection is done along the way and uh, as you can see in the picture is the result of the detection. Uh, IRDD is the AI uh, powered device. It has a convolutional neural network with a performance of 83% of the general object detection model. So. Um, uh, what makes our uh, solution also more important is that char it is characterized uh, for uh, Algeria. We have walked over 50 kilometers and uh, collected over 7,000 images with more than 1,200 defects detected. Uh, these defects are classed into uh, these five classes. Uh, we can also here see a demonstration of uh, the device placed in the dashboard and uh, the detections are sent into a mobile application along with some statistics. Uh, why us? Why IRDD? Uh, manual and traditional uh, inspections are uh, high in cost and also are not automatic. There are other AI-based solutions around the world, for instance, Vicella in Europe, uh, Roadbotics in Australia, and University of Waterloo is doing AI field testing. Our solution is uh, low in cost, automatic, easy to use, and more importantly, personalized for Algerian roads. Uh, we, our startup, sell software and hardware solutions to municipalities and private road firms in the form of one by one time by device and uh, a yearly or monthly subscription. We estimated our market size to be 480 million dinars, and uh, we <coughs> And we expect uh, 84 million dinars by the third year, having uh, a price of 100,000 dinars per device and 120,000 dinars per license per year. We plan to reach our uh, customers by developing a website uh, that has specifications of our product and represent propositions and eventually field assistance. Uh, we have now a uh, first uh, tested version ready and deployed, so we plan to enter the market in 2022, inshallah, then um, uh, starting by only three wilayas and then extending to whole Algeria, uh, maybe after going to Africa and the MENA region since it can have a similar structure, and uh, then extending internationally uh, and answering tenders, offer of tenders. Uh, so what we need, what we ask for, is uh, at least 3.5 million dinars to cover the costs of development and hardware and communication and marketing expenses. We are uh, a team of four. I invite my team to join me on stage. On the technical side, we have uh, Mohamed Habi and I, uh, Nariman Hindhanouni. And the uh, business side, Ihab Nassim and Haji Ishaq Bishaqi for the UI. Je vous remercie pour votre présentation. Euh, ma première question, qu'est-ce que vous allez vendre Un service ou un système A Device. Device, yeah. entier. Uh, yeah, we said we that... Sell both. So, we sell both software and hardware. So it's uh, one by hardware and a renewable contract for the software. OK. Uh, Est-ce que vous avez mesuré aussi la dangerosité des, des, affaires, des artefacts, c'est-à-dire vous avez euh, détecté des artefacts au niveau de la route, vous avez fait des statistiques, est-ce que vous avez mesuré la dangerosité, c'est-à-dire euh, euh, donner un bilan lorsque j'ai euh, tant d'artefacts, j'ai euh, une dangerosité, euh, euh, par exemple, de mesurer entre 0 et 1 
uh, we did not measure uh, how uh, how the defects can uh, can impact. Yeah, but we we plan on doing that. So it's this. Uh, this is just uh, a first version, and we plan to do some improvements for the next version, inshallah. And especially what sh what you talked about. Merci pour euh, euh, ma question. Euh, C'est question de, de, de performance. Vite, vous plaît, pour le temps. Si vous embarquez mmh. votre caméra et il y a de la circulation, est-ce que vous arrivez à, à, à détecter convenablement So, you mean if there, there are a lot of cars, if we can detect the uh, the defects? Okay. So we. Yeah, uh, we did not take that case into consideration, so... But the detection will be done by... Uh, uh, he is in a trip to do inspection. So he will not be stuck in traffic or because it's his mission to detect the, the defects. Okay, so, so if he's in traffic, he, he must slow down seconds, a little bit too. Seconds, vous plaît. Yes, in, Rahman, oui. in your competition analysis, your software says that it's specialized for Algeria. Now the software, whether it's a Chinese or Japanese road or American road, the same. Why did you say it's specialized for Algeria? Uh, like we mentioned in the presentation, we collected uh, Algerian data and we, we have seen that uh, road data is different from one country to another and the structure of roads is different. So that's why it's personalized for Algeria. So we trained our model on Algerian data that we collected and we annotated. Merci. Thank you.